Hey guys, what's up? It's Jess. So today is going to be kind of a kind of sit down and talk to you video. Like, I mean, it was Q and A in my last video that I literally just uploaded two days ago. So my schedule is a little bit whack right now, but I'll figure it out. Um, this is going to be very unedited. Um, just kind of just a quick little kind of hopefully motivational video because tonight was something I will never forget for as long as I live. As something as little as this made a huge impact on me and I wanted to kind of share that with you guys because it's something I'm super proud of and it's something that I love doing and it's kind of sharing my story I guess. So, let me kind of tell a little backstory on this. In about 7th grade, 7th, 8th grade, I uploaded a music video to Fight Song by Rachel Platten. It was not good, voice-wise. The video was good, everything else was good, but not my voice. And that kind of, that's kind of how people found my YouTube channel, and they use that video for blackmail they use that video for really negative hurtful words and from not just my peers but also just regular bullies online and I eventually turned off the comments on that video because I knew it wasn't my best but at the time it didn't sound horrible to me because I hadn't really, I didn't know, you know, I didn't really know what was bad and what was good because I didn't take singing seriously by that point. So, ever since then, I've been called a fight song girl. I've been this told that I'm horrible at singing. I've been told that, you know, I, you know, I've just been told all these different things and Tonight was something, like, that totally changed my perspective on that. I did my school's talent show, which I know sounds so stupid, like, why are you making a video about this? And the reason why is because it was something I did not expect at all. I, before I even went out there, when they were introducing me, I heard screams and I heard cheers and, like, just pure like support and that's all I wanted all I wanted was to feel supported and and so I was like okay you know this is fine I walk out and everybody's screaming like a maniac and freaking out and I'm like oh like okay and as the performance is going people are singing along they're waving their phone flashlights they're like it was the single most amazing moment of my entire high school life. You know, I've only been in it for two years, not even yet. I took away from tonight as something powerful in me because the people that were in the crowd and in the back and even in backstage who were all just mentally preparing me and physically preparing me and helping me like breathe and you know and the crowd, just the crowd was so awesome and it was so rewarding because that's me that they're, that they're singing along to. That's me that the flashlights are waving to. It was just so, I can't even like, I'm, I'm speechless. Like I don't even know what to say. Hearing those people, seeing those people after the show, during the show, who came out just because they wanted to see me or just because, you know, they were bored and they had nothing else to do. And hearing the impact that, you know, people were like, you did so good or, oh my gosh, good job, you've, you're, 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 you've improved. The best comment I ever get when I do stuff like this is you've improved so much and that makes me feel so good because it shows that people still remember that fight song video do I really care anymore? No, I've learned recently to just stop caring what people think, especially when it happened three or four years ago. And seeing all the people, yeah? Yeah? In a minute. 
Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, so what I guess I'm trying to say is that I kind of hid my talent from the fight song video to freshman year of high school. Because I was scared of people judging me like they did when they heard the fight song video. When freshman year rolled around, I started slowly getting more into covers and, you know, and I mean, I didn't really post a lot of covers or anything on this channel because, again, I was scared. And eventually, I did post a few and, you know, I didn't really get a lot of comments on it or anything like that and I was totally okay with that. Like, it didn't really matter to me. But when I'm on stage performing for a lot of people that are screaming my name, that are chanting my name, that are screaming in general, that are singing along, that are waving their flashlights, it's so rewarding. I can't even, like, express to you guys. Like, it was the single most just incredible feeling I've ever experienced. And you guys are the reason why I am still doing what I love. The people that came tonight, the people that got pictures with me afterwards, the people said, oh my god, you totally deserve to win. Those people are the people that are going to, I'm going to remember for a lifetime. No matter if we've talked maybe once, twice, or maybe this was your first time talking to me tonight. No matter how, no matter how many words you've said to me in the past four years since Fight Song, no matter if it was hate or if it was nice comments... Tonight, I heard all nice things. There was no negativity. And that was awesome. Because people seem to love hearing me sing and coming to watch me and support me. It was just so comforting. I can't even, like, express that enough. Like, I, I was, I have been dreaming of you know, performing on stage and having a ton of people chant my name and, you know, feeling like a, like, just, just kind of feeling like comfortable. I felt comfortable and I know I was still nervous, but at the same time, I was just comfortable because of the people who were in the audience and scream and chant. If you chanted my name or if you screamed or if you sang along or if you gave me a, sta I got a standing ovation from a lot of people. That was really cool. That was something I never expected at all. And walking in and walking out, uh, walking on and walking off the stage, hearing people are still screaming as I'm walking off the stage, even when the next act is, act is about to go on. I just can't even tell you guys how much that means to me. Because it shows that I've improved. It shows that people still support me, even though the video I posted four or five like, three or four years ago, was so embarrassing and so, like, oh my god, I don't want anything a part of her because of that video. So, I guess what, like, the lesson I want to teach you guys is that if you're scared of something, or if you're, if you think you're pretty good at something, and you're scared to show it off, but when some, if a person finds out about it, they're gonna want you to go and, like, show it off. Whether that be art, or whether that be singing, or dancing, or piano, or whatever it is. I encourage all of you to do something you're scared of in front of people. And if you are in the same situation like me, where there was a video that kind of was embarrassing, or it was just not good, show your improvement. Make people regret making fun of you in middle school or high school. Because that is what I want to teach people. I was bullied so much in middle school that I called in sick so many days because I just didn't want to come. I didn't want to see people because of that video. But now I love coming to school because of the people who actually support me. And it's just so crazy to me that so many people came out. And I heard so many people today and tonight saying, I just came for you. I just came to watch you sing. You were so good tonight. I'm so proud of you. I can't even. Like, I'm going to start crying. Like, I, 
thank you. Just thank you to anybody who heard about the talent show and said good luck or said congratulations or said I'm pr they're proud of me because I love that feeling of someone being proud of me. And I, from my parents, from my peers, no matter who did that. A random mom came up to me after the talent show today and was like, that was so good. And I was like, thank you so much. Like, go out and do something you're scared of. It's scary, but do it. You won't regret it. I mean, I don't. The impact I made on people, the people that, you know, came to just see me, or, I mean, there's other amazing acts tonight, don't get me wrong. I'm, I wasn't the only one. But it was just awesome. So from the bottom of my heart to anybody who came to town, or even anybody who said good, good job or congratulations, or anybody who just watched my videos and enjoy some, thank you. Just thank you for for never letting me give up on what I love to do. Because if I, if I would have, I wouldn't, you know, be doing what I'm doing right now. I wouldn't be doing talent shows. I wouldn't be singing a solo by myself. And to anybody who made fun of me in middle school who were there tonight, I saw a lot of people in the audience that used to make fun of me in middle school so much for this video. And, and for my YouTube channel in general. And they were watching me in the audience tonight. And hearing them say good job or hearing them say congratulations. I just, it, in my mind, I'm like, thank you. But also, I'm also like, well, I proved you wrong. There is hope. I know it may seem like, you know, if something really embarrassing is happening to you and you don't know how to handle it, just go out there and prove those people wrong and say, hey, I'm here. I'm present. I can do better than this. And you won't regret it. I'm just going to end it here because it's already getting a little long. But seriously, f let me, I'm going to wrap this up. Thank you all so much for coming out tonight. Thank you for just spending a dollar and walking in and just expecting not, may maybe not a lot. Maybe you were just expecting it to be like adequate or maybe not even good at all. And the, just, just, just the amount of love and support I got from a lot of people tonight was so amazing and i can't wait to see what the future holds for me next year i'm doing talent show senior year i'm doing talent show you best be knowing i'm going to do talent show all four years of high school because that is something i love to do is sing on a stage because that's where i belong that is my home that is that is just incredible so thank you to the exec board thank you to the people who came out thank you to my parents thank you Anybody who told me to not give up on singing because I wouldn't be here and I wouldn't be this happy and this overwhelmed if it weren't for you. And I'm so grateful for you and everything you do. And for those of you who just like my videos and encourage me to make more videos, thank you. Because, like, I don't know where I'd be. I don't know if I'd still be making YouTube videos if it weren't for the people that actually like my videos. Alright, I'm going to wrap this up here. I love you guys. Thank you for letting me live my dream. And... Love you. Bye.